Waddle, great strike by Tonga by Lowe. Pressure coming. Intercepted in the end zone. What's up fans, Travis Wingfield here, and you're watching Dolphins Today coming to you from the Baptist Health Studios here in Miami Gardens. Well, the Dolphins coaching staff has continued getting a makeover in recent weeks with the arrival of Mike McDaniel, who is bringing some familiar faces back to South Florida. Three of his coaching staff hires have included new receivers coach Wes Welker, cornerbacks coach and passing game specialist Sam Madison, and defensive assistant Patrick Sertan. Let's get familiar with these three additions. Welker returns to the Dolphins having played three seasons in Miami, where he set the team single season record for all purpose yards back in 2005. Welker trails only Gale Sayers for the most all purpose yards in a player's first three NFL seasons. Madison's 31 interception as a Dolphin rank only behind Jake Scott and Dick Anderson for the most in team history. The former All Pro DB joins Miami staff having won a Super Bowl both as a player with the Giants and a secondary coach with the Kansas City Chiefs. And for Sertan, the three-time Pro Bowler returns to South Florida, where he recorded 29 interceptions and 353 tackles in 108 career appearances as a Miami Dolphin. Welcome back to Miami, guys. All right, Dolphins fans, next up, we're going to help you get a little more familiar with defensive assistant Patrick Sertan. Prior to joining Coach McDaniel's staff here in Miami, Sertan had been the head coach at American Heritage High School in Plantation, Florida. He recently allowed us to tour his home near the school, so we wanted to share some of the best moments of his hospitality. Enjoy the tour right here. Now we're in the foyer of the home and we wanted to be a, a grand entrance, so that's what you see with the, the chandelier here, the table, obviously the, the oversized mirrors. You know, we, we wanted to be a a focal point in the house leading into the, uh, the formal living room. This is the room where normally nobody sits. <laughs> Obviously, it, it's off the bar, so you know we, we use the bar area for, for entertainment, but as far as the formal living room, we kind of stay, stay off this area. Obviously, with, with the, the big windows, it, it looks out to the pool, so this is another great focal point of the home. The art, I'm a big art guy, so a couple of paintings. I like the, the, the decor of it, just the, the, the sleek white. You know, we wanted to keep a modern touch to it, and I think the board provides that. When some family and friends come over and we want to just, just kick it out here and just listen to the sounds of the water, we'll, we'll sit here at the bar, have the games on, and just just vibe, you know, just, just relax. Yeah, that's the best part about this house is sharing it with, with, with other people. Poor trampoline, been through it. What people don't know, they know me as Pat, the professional football player. But back in my day in high school, I was all state, won state championships, and make shots like that. Juice, you remember those days, man, back in the early 2000s when we were at the crib. Ah! Ah! Short again. That's how you do it. Thank you guys for coming out, seeing my home. Uh, shout out to Amerisave for, for putting this together. The old saying goes, you don't have to go home, but you gotta get the hell out of here. Peace. Before we let you go, Dolphins fans, let's get a little on-field access from the 2021 season. In an effort to relive some of the most fun moments from the year, here are some of the best moments from Miked Up. Check it out. Nah, my dad is though. It's us against the world, baby. Let's keep this going. Let's go. Hey, fans on two. One, two. Man, first of all, it ain't just us. Two, who the f go on two? Nick, Nick. Hey, that's my helmet. Get my up. What's wrong with you, man? Come on, Nick. Hey, listen up. Right here, one play at a time. Don't worry about any other play. Go, Ruff. 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 Inside the 40 and goes over a tackler. Oh, let's go! It had been quick. It had been quick. Kasuki falling inside the 10. Third and two, third and six, third and 15. Throw me the ball. We, we play, we go get a three and out. And let's try to, you know what I'm saying? What's that call? 
because we get the ball back out the half. Double dip. Double dip this like like the ice cream. Uh chocolate fudge. I'm hungry as hell. Let's go, baby. Let me have my water at, man. Hey, you know New York was like the first unofficial capital of the United States. Unofficially, of course. Someone who's come out onto the field, they will stop play. The kick will be suspended. Yeah, they don't do nothing here. They don't tag you with a guy. They dapping them up. You see my catch? Huh? Did you see my catch and run? Yeah. Does that count as trucking somebody? Carr gets rid of it. Intercepted. A Landon Roberts is going to go all the way. You still tired, bro? Damn, Ed, come on. I'm good. Give it to him. Bro, I'm in shape, Todd. You feel me? Yeah, Ed, come on. Get some oxygen from the side, bro. Intercepted. Howard to the pick six. Yeah! Now you bro. Keep balling. Dexter, Dexter. What's up, Brody? Y'all didn't see my pops? Yeah, everybody talking about my mama. My father right there. All right, that's a wrap for Dolphins today from the Baptist Health Studios. We'll see you back here on Friday. In the meantime, check out the Drive Time Podcast with yours truly, Travis Wingfield, three days a week in the offseason, five days a week end season, wherever you get your podcasts from. Until then, fins up. <laughs>